What's up, YouTube? I am doing just a quick little video um, to say thank you to all the people that left comments on the rant um, about people today. I mean, I have received some private negative messages for one, you know, going back and forth with a woman of age, but not too old. And to me, it's not so much about going back and forth with her, but I am not a 16-year-old little girl. At the end of the day, I am a grown woman, a wife, a mother, you know, and I am someone's daughter, but I should not have to tolerate another woman, no matter her age, talk to me the way she did. I don't care if she was a younger woman talking to me, let's say 27. Still, it's disrespectful either way it go. But anyway, we're not going to worry about that because we have enough of that going on on YouTube now with everybody. Um, not everybody. I shouldn't say that with people um, hating on other people. It's that opening up arms and congrat congratulating and, you know, encouraging each other on here. But I have a haul, but I kind of left it in the truck. <laughs> so... Um, I don't know. This is going to be kind of weird, but, um, I had to mineralize skin finish in the previous videos back, and I didn't like it. Neither one of them. I brought both of them back. So, I wanted something for work. Something lightweight, not too heavy. I can just throw on just to have some type of coverage on my face because now I was doing like the pressed powder or just the mineralized um, skin finish and medium dark itself. So tonight I actually at lunch went to MAC and got the um, mineralized satin finish with SPF 15 and NC 44 and I'm wearing it um, now so you know it's not too bad you know I, I know one thing we would never ever be able to try to figure out how wild with ears on one color was not hitting the sun so I mean it's nice just the way it is and she also talked me into wearing a blush to work because like I say with the type of job I have I really don't wear makeup to work that often so the blush of choice was Amberine Rose and I have on my phone everything that I own. It's just this Amber and Rose name just kept sticking out, sticking out, sticking out like I had it. Maybe I don't. I, when I get home, I will check it. But, yeah. So, um, let me zoom in so you can kind of get a better look of it. And she also concealed under my eye with the studio, um... Sculpt concealer to kind of like brighten it up. So I kind of do like that. I'm I'm trying just to let it all marinate in and um and stuff. So this is the the blush and um hmm, it don't look too bad. So yeah, so she did NC42 Studio Sculpt Concealer under my eye, just kind of like to brighten it up a little bit. And she set that with some mineralized skin finish. So, I don't know if that will be something I will go back and purchase. Because to me, it's like I can see all my lines and wrinkles and everything <laughs> underneath. So, um, yeah, we will see. So, you guys take care. I'm sorry I didn't have the bottles. But I guess I just put the link for MAC. And then you can kind of like see, see it. I don't know. It all depends. Maybe i do it in another video. Show the amber and rose and the bottle of um, satin finish what's a haul with our products yeah i know <laughs> you guys enjoy your friday i'm at work so i'll talk to you guys later bye